So we've got a couple of key titles. One is Unreal, um, which is a 10-part series for Lifetime. Uh, starts airing January, oh, June the 1st even. Uh, so a little bit of time to go before that comes out. So we're showing people episodes here for the first time. And then we've got Secret Life of Marilyn Munro, uh, which is a two times 94-hour mini-series uh, for Lifetime again, which airs in uh, May. And we're just showing, you know, first material from, from that show here. Scripted shows have, have come to, you know, define those channels to a greater extent. So a channel like History, which previously actually didn't have any scripted on, very, very defined by Vikings, which is a, you know, a, an important show for the channel. We'd launched Danny Studios six months ago, uh, really to, to help, um, you know, provide our networks with what they need in terms of that core scripted content and to build up our own production and ownership of rights on, on shows going forward so we can you know, work with the international market. MIP TV is interesting for us. It's been a, a, a slightly different one actually for us, we felt. Uh, you know, it felt like a little bit of an old-fashioned market. We're doing lots of sales meetings. We're doing sales. There's deals getting done on the stand, which you know is interesting. Less corporate side kind of partnerships and big talks about grand things, and more, you know, what we used to do, which is selling shows. So, yeah, for us, it's been good. We have a presence at, and that's that's becoming more important as we get more involved in scripted. Traditionally, for us, it's been a Latin-driven uh, uh, market, if you like. Um, then beyond that, uh, we, we, we will be entertaining some of the disc shows as well in Turkey and uh, probably Central Europe as well. So there's a lot of you know, shows in specific markets which are smaller shows, you know, more one-to-one uh, more -one shows if you like, uh, where we don't have a huge presence as a corporation, but it's important.